Hi everyone. Hi, welcome to Thrifty Thursday. Welcome back to my journey back to health. Um, today's Thrifty Thursday, and I wanted just to come on and share briefly a thrifting haul of some of the things that I recently got um, between. And this thrifting haul is a little different. Some of this is between some of the things that I actually went out to a thrift store and found this past week. And some of this, some treasures that I found, um, we actually moved my mom this past um, weekend. And when helping her move, I found some old things of my own and that still actually are quite into um, play right now in this season of, you know, fashion and stuff like that. That's why I have time to live the whole on the stuff because fashion doesn't do anything but repeat itself. Um, so I just wanted to come on and share those things that I was able to find and just give you guys a heads up. Some of this stuff I will be reposting for sale on my Instagram consignment shop, which I will post that information in the description box below. But this will be information. It is Florence Festival Finds, um, at, um, and that's on Instagram, at Florence Festival Finds. So you can find some of the things and other things that I found in the past that may not have shown or that have shown other videos on it as well that you'll be able to purchase for very reasonable. So let's get started. So this first one here is a Target little skirt that I found. I just saw this the last time I went to that same Goodwill. <clears throat> and I said, well, I decided against it at the time that I was getting some other things. But this time I said, oh, let me go ahead and see it again. So I thought it was really cute. It's just like one of those little, like, um, I guess you call it a skater skirt. It has an elastic waist and the tie the tie in the front. I think this was like four hours since this was changed. It was a pretty like fuchsia color. That's what I really liked about it. So it's really fun. Just cute to wear that before the summer's out. As you guys know, I am a mom, so when I go thrifting, I'm not just looking for big items or things I can sell things for myself. I also look at kids' clothes. And so this one was a cute little I thought it was a cute little um shirt that says rock with some glitter on it. You know I have three older girls and a little boy so I'm out here for girly stuff. And um, this was actually one dollar. Again, another one, a cute little like jean skirt. I really like those details, those little button details. Those are so cute, super cute. And that's another denim skirt for the child. And this was again another one for a dollar. The purpose of going in the thrift store was actually to get some black slacks for work. So. I actually came out and was able to get that. And not only did I get them, but I actually got a pair that were brand new. And this actually is a brand new so from Nordstrom's originally, you can see on the tag. And I got these brand new for five dollars. Like a little bit of waist. My band has some pockets on the back. You may not be able to see that, but it's actually a boot cut at the bottom. Yep. It's a brand spanking new, so I'm pleased to clean this. And then, like I said, with $5, I believe. Something like that. Like $5.40 five, five, something. Something like that. And then, baby Zach. I love overalls on little boys. And these were some. Really nice Osh Gosh ones in excellent good condition. Yep. And these actually will only have this particular Google that I go to sometimes. They have a special area called Dollar 33 where everything on there right is dollar the model dance for dollar thirty three cent and this was one of them. So this was a dollar and thirty three cent. And it's again so Osh Gosh the Gosh. Um Vintage, you know, don't go out of style overalls. Sorry, today's gonna bring us back for adults too. I don't know if I can get with that, but yeah. Okay, and then we have this. I got some shoes for the um, oldest girl. These were $1.99. So I got them in enough size she can wear them now. And she actually, we like, like to call her Bigfoot because she wears an adult size 7. So um, these are actually an 8. So it should be the word is and hopefully it's next year as well. So it's one ninety nine. Then, as you guys may have seen on my Instagram, which is at my journey back underscore 2016. And the other day I posted how I found some shoes for one cent in, in Nordstrom's. And these were those shoes. 
Um, they actually are the brand um, Hopper Canyon. And they were one cent. She actually has worn them since then, but yep, I just wanted to show these with the shoes. That was real. Then these were some more shoes um, that I got for that same one, the middle girl. And these were in the um, actually at the Goodwill, and they were $4.99. Brand new. Not bad. They were brand new. They were tied together stuff, but she's worn them since then. Another pair of flip flops for Bigfoot. Since she's grown up everything, there's some um, Target brand. They actually will in there for one ninety nine, brand new. They had the tags and the hooks and stuff on them. Yep. So I said nothing else. This stuff would be for her going to the next season. And now some of the stuff that I found in the, my um in our when we were moving my mom and my old stuff. So check this out. Gucci. So I forgot all about this bag I had. It's a Gucci fanny pack that I have. That I forgot all about. And I've been wanting a fanny pack so bad so when I for when I go out exercise and I put my stuff in. And lo and behold, I already had one. So thank God I don't have to spend no money. So not just to spend no money, but I had a stylish one already. Now if it's hundred percent real, authentic. Um, I don't know about that one, but it's, it'll do me the case. It'll do for me, and it's so cute. Yeah, and it has. I love the little. I love the ones that have the authentic um, colors on the side. Okay, and then this so cute pink crossbody bag that I found in my old stuff. I forgot I bought a lot of stuff that I had. Now I might be reposting this one. I'm not sure. This actually was a Monique handbag. Yeah, that's a Monique. I don't even see finals anymore. So, yep. And then this beauty here had a little bit of wear to it on the bottom, but I think that can be fixed. Was this cute, cute, cute Tommy hair figure, um, like a book bag. You can see the, the, the TH over there on the strap. You can see on the front down there. Yep. So. And this was definitely authentic. Something I forgot all about it. I had. So, loving that one. Probably will be post that for a free sale. And then I forgot I had this um this here also. So, I, this is another thing that I found in my um, search with help when my move, I should say, with helping my mom. Was this cute little old navy skirt. Yeah, it's so cute with it. And I, it's it's like an A-line skirt, and at the bottom it has, you know, this pink trimming at the bottom. It's so cute. It's like a, a leaf print with on it. So that you actually could wear this right now. And then I am Mickey Mouse. I've always been a Mickey Mouse fan, so it's no, it's no, um, it's not new to me. It's nothing new that my children actually have a big love for Mickey Mouse. This is about, this is about me really knowing what the, how much I was obsessed with him. And I was able to find this in my collection of the stuff that we were unpacking for my mom. And I had this vintage, so cute, Mickey Mouse pajama gown. Isn't that adorable? Look at him. <laughs> so, yeah. So, that was it, you guys. That was my thrifting haul for this time around. Um, it wasn't anything really huge. It was a little different. Like I said, it was a combination of things that I found. When thrifting in my own home, in my own, you can go thrifting in your own garage, your own shed, you know, moving. It's all kinds of different ways to thrift, not just in a store or just purchasing things. So, um, like I said, definitely check me out at Small Sessions. We'll find some of these items as well as other things, others that I may have posted in the past where you can find them very reasonably and cute, vintage, modern finds, as well as connect with me on my journey back underscore 2016 on Instagram. You can catch me on my um, Facebook website at www.facebook.com, myjourneyback.florence.com. So thank you guys for checking me out. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Hit the subscribe button below. The red button, subscribe, subscribe. And check me out because there will be more videos to come. Thanks. Check you guys later. Ta-ta.